Hey everyone, it's Amy, and I'm here to show you how to create an animation that shows emphasis for one character. We're back here using Piscal again. Again, the website is piscalapp.com. And the first thing that you're going to do is click sign in to your account. Click to find your name. And you're back here to your gallery. We're not editing anything that we've already created. Today we're going to create something new. So we're going to click on Create Sprite. Again, this is our dashboard. We're going to be using the Draw tool, the Paint Bucket tool, the Eraser tool, and the Circle tool today. So what we're going to do today is we're going to draw three to four emojis, and we're going to emphasize one emoji by having it move, and the other ones will not move. Now, if you remember from before, our drawing space is kind of small. So we want to make our drawing space a little bit bigger, have a little bit more room. So we're going to resize it. And the way you do that is you go over here to this button right here. It says resize. You're going to click on it. Right now it tells us that the size of our creation pane is 32 pixels by 32 pixels. That's about the size of an emoji that's on a phone. We want to make it bigger. So we're going to click right here in the middle. And then we're going to change this to 170 by 170. Okay, no worries. And then you're just going to click off here to the side, or excuse me, you're going to click resize. And now it's that size. So now you're all ready to draw three to four emoji. Now don't forget to resize like I just showed you. That's a really important step. I'm going to draw my emojis and then I'll come back. All right, here are my four emojis now. I need to pick one emoji that I'm going to emphasize by using movement. So I could pick any of these, but I'm only going to pick one. And the one that I'm going to pick is this one right here. So what I need to do is I need to duplicate this frame. So I hover and I click on duplicate frame. Now I have two and I need to change this one. Remember, just like we did in the first video. In this case, I think I'm going to do a tongue again, but I'm going to draw it really long. Okay, and then I need to fill it in. Okay, there we go. Do you see how it's moving there? Now I can make it slower or faster. I like that. Excellent. Nice job there. So in frame two, I'm emphasizing the first excuse me, this one emoji. Now, I'm going to add another frame. In this frame, I'm going to pick a different emoji to emphasize. I'm going to pick this one. It's the same thing. I want to change something there. I'm going to make this guy super angry. So do you see right there? So this one's being emphasized and then this one's being emphasized. Do you see? Really cool, right? Now, once you're all done, what you're going to do is you're going to click on save. And then I would say, let's call this one emphasis emoji. And we're going to choose save to gallery. It's going to save there. And once again, we're emphasizing this emoji by making the tongue move. We're emphasizing this emoji by making angry eyebrows. If you ever want to see the sprites you've created, you just click on my gallery and you'll see them all. And look, there's this one all over again.